What's good, YouTube? This your boy Chiwara back at y'all again with another art tutorial, man. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that like button, comment, subscribe, make sure you click post notifications so you'll be notified every time your boy drops some heat. In today's video, we back at it again. I will be showing you guys how to get better at shading. So without further ado, let's jump right into this video. And I repeat, this is not a art tutorial. As far as a drawing tutorial, this is a how to shade tutorial. So don't judge me for the drawing skills that you will be seeing in this video. All right, now let's jump into it. I had to do my little disclaimer. Okay, let me go ahead and find a picture we're gonna use. And what picture we gonna, we gonna use. And the more we do it, the better you'll get at doing it. That's why we're gonna, you're gonna see a lot of these shading videos. Okay, I found a picture to use. Okay, let's go ahead. Uh, okay, let me do a quick little, let me do a, a quick little rough sketch of the dude, so we can go ahead and get a nice little layout, so, go ahead and sketch out his, draw out his face. Y'all know my drawing skills is A1, so please don't play me like, bro, they don't look, they don't look like the picture, bro. Because I just told you, bro, it ain't about that. It's about me trying to teach y'all how to get better at shading. We already know you boy can draw now, so don't play me. Don't come at, don't come at me sideways, please don't. And this tutorial, it ain't gonna be too in depth with the the detail of the shading. I just want to make it simple as possible. So with that said, now look, we create me a layer for my shading. And what we gonna do? We gonna focus on the main shadows, like which is right here. You notice it's coming from this side of the face. It comes right here, it comes right here. So you just gotta practice on finding the shadows and really just following your picture. You know what I'm saying? Because let me show y'all. I'm just following my picture where I see where I see the shadows that on my picture. And we only doing one color shadow. So I'm gonna just show y'all with knowing how to find your shadows, how much of a difference it'll make. And I'm only using one shadow layer. We ain't gonna go too far in depth. We just gonna find the main shadows. This way, comes back over here. Because if you practice this at least once a day, just getting better at shading, and when it's time to really draw a picture you spend time on, your art gonna look amazing, bro. But nothing comes without practice. So you just gotta find the time to. And look at my picture now. If you notice, I'm not doing anything different from what I see. I'm just, I'm just copying exactly where I see the shadows are placed on this picture, on the original. So it's a, it's a lot of dark spots on this ear.
know what I'm saying? That's all it is, man. I think a lot of people, when they think of doing shadows, they, they overthink it all automatically where they just be like, man, it's hard. That's the only thing I can't do, but it's not hard. I believe a lot of people make it harder than what it actually is. As you can see, I just copied exactly what I see. You know what I'm saying? I'm just copying exactly what I see. This shadow can come up some. That's all you do is copy exactly where you see the shadows at on your original picture. That's all I'm doing. And that's pretty much it. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I will get more advanced with the picture. You know what I'm saying? But we got to start out small with baby steps because I know it's a lot of people out there that ain't that advanced yet. But you work your way up to being advanced. So we're going we gonna to start with baby steps and we're going to get more advanced later on down the line. Let me see. He got a shot on his top lip. See? Just find time to practice. Do you, like what I just did here, do you a quick sketch? Because that the sketch is not your focus. What we're trying to work on skill-wise is our shading. So do a quick rough sketch to give you a nice little layout. And then truly practice on finding and training your eye to be able to find the, the shadows and the tones and stuff like that. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you stay tuned. Mohi coming soon. And I'm out this thing.